Hi, my name is Wendy. I'm a P4 pharmacy student. Hi, my name is Zachary. I'm a P4 pharmacy student as well. We're both pharmacy students at the University of Texas at Austin, and today we're going to show you how to fill a prescription. First off, you will get a prescription from your doctor, and so when the prescription comes in, you'll want to um, make sure that you have the right drug. So for this prescription, we're going to be working with carprofen, and it'll be a 100 milligram tablet and we'll need uh, five tablets to fill this prescription. Um, and we're giving it one tablet every 12 hours. And so this will be for two and a half days. Okay. Okay, so now that we've fully read our prescription, we're going to go ahead and pick out our product. So since we're working with carprofen, we have several different formulations here. We have carprofen 25 milligrams, carprofen 75 milligrams, and carprofen 100 milligrams. Our prescription calls for carprofen 100 milligram tablets. So we are going to pick the carprofen 100 milligram tablets. We're going to go ahead and double check that again to make sure we have that correctly. I have it correct. And we're going to verify that the concentration is correct and that we can use this tablet, which we can. We're going to then take these other two formulations that we don't need and put those to the side. Okay, so now we're going to actually count the prescription. You'll take your pill counting tray, it looks like this, and put it on the counter in front of you. And then you'll pour your medications into here. you'll want to take your little spatula, count in groups of five, and since we need five pills for our, to fill our prescription, I'll just go ahead and count out five like this, and just kind of push the other ones to the side. Okay, so now that we have our pills appropriately counted, we're going to go ahead and get them ready to be dispensed into the vial. So the first thing we want to do is open our channel lid, and we're going to scoop our five pills into the channel lid. We then want to go ahead and close this lid. The next thing we want to do is get rid of the other tablets that we have on the tray. So we need to pick up our tablet, make sure we tilt this way so our pills don't fall at the front end, grab our stock bottle, and return them to the stock bottle that we got the set pills out of. Just like that. You then want to place your counting tray back down, and we want to go ahead and close our stock bottle lid to make sure it's all sealed. So now we're going to, cha to transfer this medication into the vial right here. And so without touching the medication, you want to just place it over the vial like this and just kind of let it drop in like that. And then once all the medication is in the bottle, you just want to close the lid like so. Okay, now that we have our drug counted and packaged, the next thing we're going to do is fill out our label. As you can see here, I have a blank label. So the first thing we want to write on our label is our date. Today is 1-23-17. So I'm going to go ahead and write that down. The next thing we want to make sure we write is the prescribing doctor's name. So for this patient, it is going to be Dr. Amy who wrote this prescription. If you have a last name, you want to make sure you include that last name. The next thing we want to make sure we put on there is the name of our patient. This medication today is for a dog named Sammy. So I'm going to go ahead and write Sammy down. And we also want to include the species of the dog since different species can have different issues related to medication. So Sammy our patient today is a golden retriever. So we're going to go ahead and write that on our label. The next thing we want to make sure we do is write the drug down along with the quantity and the strength. So we, I'm going to go ahead and write carprofen, which is the drug we use today, 100 milligrams, and the quantity we're dispensing, which is five tablets. The next thing we want to make sure we include is the directions of how Sammy's going to take this medication. So Sammy's going to take one tablet by mouth, every 12 hours. He's also going to have three refills on this medication, so we're going to make sure that we write three refills are available. That way the patient knows how many refills they have left. And they can order more if they need it. And the last thing we want to do is include any type of special consideration. So with carprofen, the doctor made sure that we wanted to include that it needs to be taken with food. So we're going to include that on the label. That way some of these owners know that they need to give it with food. Okay, so now we have our completed label right here, as you can see right here. All right, and then we're going to go ahead, tape it onto our bottle, and we're now finished filling this medication.